The Knights are home tonight against Montreal. Yeah, hockey has seen a tremendous growth spurt in the Valley. Ron Futrell is here now with the latest striking goal. Okay, Brian and Kirsten, I, I don't know if you know this, but, but hockey is a big deal in the Northeast, probably in Chicago and other places besides Vegas. But, oh, but here in Las Vegas, there is one team that stands alone. It's an early morning wake-up call, 6 a.m. at City National Arena, and they are in there, Faith Lutheran hockey players working hard and blazing trails. I get up at 5, but I live kind of far. But once you get up and you kind of get to the rink and get on all your gear, you know, you don't mind. They are the only high school hockey team in the Valley, and the Crusaders are hoping they have company soon. It'd be nice if, you know, Gorman and some of the other schools got a hockey team. And I, I do see it happening in the near future. I mean, maybe not next year, but in the following years, I do see it happening. How do you raise money for this? That's uh, it's grassroots. It's all within. All of our families and parents go out and help. We sell programs and shirts and things of that nature. And, do it from the ground up. Now Clark County School District does not fund hockey, so the budget is tight, but they have found a great coach, former NHL and Thunder goalie Pokey Reddick. We see how hockey is growing. High school hockey is growing all over. We've been playing pretty much all over. We end up Salt Lake, Phoenix. Uh, we're going to Washington to play this year too, so we know it, it's growing and we just have to hopefully get some more schools involved. How good can this team be this year? We're good. <laughs> You're good, okay. We're, we're good. We got a lot of solid guys. Okay. Yeah, a lot of good coaching. Okay, great job there, Colton. Okay, make sure to credit your coaches as you did there. The Crusaders finished 10 and 2 last season. Their first game for this new season. Oh, is tomorrow night, 7 p.m. at City National against a high school team from Phoenix. Okay. Also from T-Mobile Arena. Oh, oh, a recent alien sighting here, folks. Oh, we've got George Knapp on this, by the way. I want you to know that remote control balloon that flies around yes. found a passenger. So I don't know if there's going to be a storm T-Mobile Arena event at some point, but it's been hanging out there, that little green guy, for the last couple of weeks. And he's pretty cute. I noticed it. I spotted it, and I said, wait a second. George needs to know, and he's looking into it. All right, George is looking into it, and boy, that kid, that hockey player, confident. Mm -hmm. Are you guys good? Oh, we're good. Oh, Colton's great. Yes. Yeah, I like that. And he's good, so he has good reason to say that. All right. Wonderful. Thank you, Ron. Thank you. We'll be right